Hey guys, welcome back to WP Payment Manager. In this video, we're gonna take a look at our split payment in action, or you can say a split payment demonstration. So for that, let's get started. Uh, as you can see, we are logged in as a user in this incognito over here, and we have our traditional admin dashboard over here. So we're gonna continue the demonstration in this browser tab over here. And for this demonstration, I have created an event using this organizer account and added some paid ticket into it to demonstrate this scenario so let's go inside the event first and here we have the event details page so as you can see as i have added the premium ticket that was 500 bucks we can add one ticket into our card and this ticket is not limited one ticket per user so we can check the card functionality as well so before going to cart let's revise what we had in our previous video so that's the fee settings we can go to our woocommerce settings and to the fees tab and we will see we have enabled our fees and default fee is five and type is percentage so that's five percent per ticket not per order and default fee level is fee and maximum fee is 200 right so let's go ahead and place the order and we will take more look into it very shortly so here in the card page we see uh, we have our subtotal as 500 and our fee as 25 so that's five percent of the ticket price over here if we increase the quantity over here and update the card the fee will go up as well by double yeah right here as you can see so let's keep it down to one as well for now uh, as we don't need multiple tickets for the demonstration so now we can go to the checkout page to view the payment method or payment process and by the end of this video we will also see how the payment on the dashboard looks like from the organizer side and how the fees looks like on the admin side right so this is a split payment so the concept behind this this split payment is admin will be able to get a fee that fee we just saw that's 25 bucks as a service charge or like platform charge for the website and the rest of the amount for tickets will go to the organizer so as you can see i have my billing details on my left and the registration details on my right so let me fill out these registration details very quickly so we can continue placing the order so now let's complete the purchase as you can see uh, initially in this website for demonstration i had direct bank transfer and check payment as a payment method since we have installed the split payment and it uses stripe so now we have credit card uh, processing over here so this is the ui what it looks like right now and as you can see we are using the test mode for stripe as for the demonstration we do not want to accept real payments with this so we can use a test card to go with the flow but keep in mind when you are using stripe split payment if you are going to accept real payments on your website make sure you provide your documentation with stripe and make your uh, stripe account live and use those credentials on your account right so let's go on with the purchase we're gonna paste uh, this card number over here and we can use any of the feature expiry date to demonstrate and any cvv so this is gonna take a few seconds and then we will land into our order confirmation page like we see over here as you can see we have order number date email total amount and payment method so this is the ordering process for the user right so user side after this user will get an email into their inbox with the payment received and the ticket itself so now let's come to our stripe dashboard and we will see how the payment looks like in our stripe dashboard so this is our test dashboard to make sure and we can go to payments we will see that we have uh, three orders over here so these two over here are previous testing results so i was testing this uh, plugin and this uh, order over here or payment is the payment we just made uh, for this order over here right so we can go inside to do the details such as the uh, payment descriptor amount fees and net amount we received status and payment method as well so if we look closely under the fee section we have 43 bucks for the fees right and if we hover over here we will see the application fee is, is equal to 25 bucks tax is 2.84 bucks and the stripe processing fee is 15.75 bucks so the application fee is the 
admin fee or the platform fee that goes to the admin of the website so this is the payment what it looks like for us who received the actual payment for the ticket but of course stripe has its own charges as well for, for payment so that we can see over here the stripe processing fee and taxes this application fee goes directly to the website admin so we're gonna take a look into it right now if we go to our stripe dashboard for admin so this is the stripe account that has been integrated into the website via admin section for that we can go to payments and we can go to collected fees we will see that we have uh two entries over here two entries because i tested once this before as i said earlier and this latest one over here is the pay we just received for the purchase so we can go even inside to view the details as well so we can see the payment details account details and uh, the application fee details as well so account details means which organizer and the payment details means uh, the order id and stuff so i hope this gave you a little bit of idea how this split payment works so keep in mind as an organizer if you didn't add or connected your stripe account whenever the user purchases your ticket full amount will go to website admin so this account over here will receive the full amount alongside with the fee since you didn't attach or connect your stripe account with the website in that way we cannot process the amount for you right so that way we will use the admin credentials for fallback and we'll process the payment using that account so in those scenarios as an organizer you can contact your website admin to settle down your payments so keeping that aside i hope this video educated you a little bit about our split payment and how this all works feel free to drop in comments if you have any queries or you fail to understand anything we will be sure to help you out until then i'm sharad saying goodbye thanks for watching and i'll catch you in the next one